Well, breaking news in the world of food. Uh, a whole bunch of Eaton Park restaurants are set to close effective... Uh, well, on January 17th, Eaton Park announced it was closing six locations due to underperforming sales. The effective uh, on the 27th on Saturday. Now, one of those included is one local to me, the one in Mill Creek. However, the one on Peach Street that I've done some reviews in will remain open. And along with that, uh, yeah, I guess it's just not doing well. I always liked Eaton Park. And I remember they said it's been around for 30 years, uh, the one in Mill Creek, I think. Because, let's see. I mean, I remember uh, going to, I mean, the Army, uh, one of my mom's friends, Pat, who used to be a friend with her a long time ago. Uh, she took me to Eaton Park a few times. I really liked the food. They have all you can eat breakfast buffet, which I thought was fantastic. And it's a shame they're going out of business. The one on Peach Street will remain open, at least for the time being. And along with that, that one restaurant that I showed in a video, two videos, over Christmas weekend, it was maybe, I, I post a little longer, a little later than that, uh, Crossroads Diner in Edinburgh is closing, it closed its doors permanently about a couple weeks back. I'm glad I got those two videos in. I guess they just weren't making the money, and then they're asking... One and a half million dollars for it. Good luck with that. I was shocked whenever Jim and Sue's bought Stepping Stone for three hundred fifty thousand dollars. I don't think it's worth that much. Maybe one hundred fifty thousand. No, no, three hundred fifty thousand. Uh, One point five million for that place? No way. So that's my breaking uh, news in the world of fast food. Uh, Why well, in the world of food, not fast food restaurants? And also, I want to mention that uh, I guess that. My friend's man, uh, that Black Panther got nominated for Best Picture, so no longer they said our uh, our comic book movies kryptonite for Best Picture not or something like that. But that's that's cool. So I hope you liked this video, buddy. Until next time, please take care, bleach. And they even had a story about Engine House Thirty Nine on uh, Channel Twelve News too, which I thought was fascinating too. All right, take care, buddy.